New at six, he's a professional skateboarder, movie star, and author. But Brandon Novak will tell you that he sees himself first and foremost as a person in recovery. And right now he is sharing his story of addiction with a crowd at Blue Mountain Union High School in Wells River. Adam Sullivan caught up with him before that event. I was a 20 year IV and heroin cocaine user. I'm Brandon Novak and this is Doo Doo Falls. And during part of that time strung out on drugs, Brandon Novak was also starring in the popular MTV movie Jackass, a pop culture phenomenon that came out in the early 2000s. In theory, you know, paper, I was a very successful individual. I did things in life that people equate to success or happiness. In reality, I was a 35-year-old homeless heroin addict. Novak, who is also a former professional skateboarder, remembers his last day high very well. He says it was one of several times he hit rock bottom. I was stranded at BWI Airport. I had just woken up from being on life support for seven days. My mother had bought me a plot. People had taken life insurance policies out on me. So he decided to get clean. Novak just celebrated three years sober. Sobriety has given me everything that drugs and alcohol had promised me. But what he says it hasn't given him is all the answers. I'm Brandon Novak, and this is Belt Sanders Skates. The MTV movie he starred in is all about taking things to the extreme and inflicting a lot of pain on the the main characters. A bit ironic since Novak says nowadays he tackles his addiction through harm reduction. So just do something. If something doesn't work, then we learn from that something and try something else. And now he's helping others. Most recently on a quick tour through Vermont, literally putting himself out there for people in need. He insisted that we share his personal cell number. And that phone number is 610 635 asked him if he missed the glitz and glamour of his past life and he said that he might have as a younger man but he's moved on and he's hoping others find the strength to do the same. The reality is if I can do it anybody can do it and that's kind of the point that I like to get out to people. Reporting in St. Johnsbury, Adam Sullivan, Channel 3 News.